Hey everybody, score one victory for Deshaun Watson's attorney, Rusty Harden. In this morning's hearing, he already got the judge to force Tony Busby to give the name of one Jane Doe. Uh, and he has, Tony Busby has two days, just two days to do it. Um, and as Harden has said, we have said this before, and we want to say it again. Deshaun did not force, coerce, or intimidate anyone to do anything against their will. When we asked Mr. Busby to identify his client weeks ago, he refused and told us to file a motion. Today, we filed that motion. As discussed in our filing, Mr. Busby's use of anonymous lawsuits violates Texas law and the basic concept of fairness. It is clear that for Mr. Busby, this case has never been about seeking justice in a courtroom, but destroying Deshaun's reputation to enhance his own public profile and enrich himself. While I understand that anonymity is often used as a shield for victims, Mr. Busby is using it as a sword. While shielding his clients from public scrutiny, Mr. Busby continues to use their anonymous allegations to destroy Mr. Watson. This is simply not right. And we look forward to resolving these matters in court. Well, he's got one's victory, and he, he's going to approach the court yet again at 11 o'clock Central Time today, uh, which is about now, actually. It's almost 12 noon in the East by about six minutes and is headed to the Maryland Burgess District Clerk Harris County envelope. Um, the, it's the case number Jane Doe in the District Court of Plaintiff versus Harris County, Texas, Deshaun Watson, defended 334th Judicial District. He's asking for what's called a special exemption to plaintiff's original petition, motion for emergency hearing, and motion to strike. And so far, and he's got it. And as he has mentioned before, this is essentially reciting of what was repeated in the statement above. So um, I remind everybody that in the case of Ashley Solis, it's already been revealed that two of her statements were not true. She wasn't suffering in her business at all. And um, she, her business is still active. And she has been hosting clients as recently as last week. So, Rusty Harden's hardball is playing off so far. Let's see what happens soon. Subscribe to Zenny62 and bookmark oaklandnewsnow.com.